Every girl, every boy, come on up in the pure eyes. There's a world right here, full of wonder and surprise. Let's go and find the thimbles. Thimbles, thimbles, thimbles. Where the thimbles? Go on, Pom. Clap your hands like me. <laughs> That's right. I didn't say waving. Flory says keep clapping. There's Bessie. Oh, hello, Bessie. Oh, hello, ducks. What are you two playing? I'm trying to play Flory says, only Pom doesn't really want to play. Oh, never mind. I'll play it with you. Oh, thanks, Bessie. Um, uh, what should I say next? Uh, oh, Flory says, flap your wings. <laughs> Flappity flap, <laughs> flap, flap. <laughs> uh, Flory says, nod your head. <laughs> and Flory says, fly around. Oh, right, uh, off I go. See you later. Flory says goodbye. Goodbye, Chuck. <laughs> Pom? Oh, Pom, come back. Oh. <laughs> oh, I'm getting that fimbling feeling. <laughs> Like a big bracelet. <laughs> wow, ribbons. Oh, oh. <laughs> I can make it shake. Thimbo, palm. Limmy, 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 lake, lake, lake. Bimmy, 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 bake, bake, bake. Hello, Rocky. <laughs> Hello, Pom. Want to see my shimmy shake? Yes, Cool. <laughs> jimmy, 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 jake, jake, jake. A zimmy, 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 zake, zake, zake. <laughs> Pom now, Pom now. Here you are, Pom. Nanny, 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 nay, nay. Now, look what I found! Coo-hoo! <laughs> Rattle, tattle, jingle, jangle, shaky, shake, shake! Yeah. Oh, can I see, Flory? Oh, thanks. It's a tambourine! Hello, Tambi! Oh, I love tambourines! Whenever I hear them, it just makes me want to dance! <laughs> this is for making music, like my shimmy shaker! So how do you play it? Well, you can hit it like this. That boy's got a tambourine like mine. Another tambourine. They look different, don't they? Yes, that one looks like a drum. Now that 
that's an accordion. Accordion. and shake it at the same time. Or you can do this with it. <laughs> or this. <laughs> or even <gasps> this. Ta da! <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a crown. Oh, yes. It could be my crown. I'm Queen Flurry. Oh, greetings, Your Majesty. <laughs> now you, Fimbo, Queen Flurry says. Greetings, Your Majesty. Hello, Queenie. Let's pretend that I'm a real queen and all of you live in my palace and you have to look after me like in the stories. Oh, yes, Your Majesty. Of course, Your Majesty. What can we do for you, Your Majesty? <laughs> oh, um... Let's think. First, we need a palace. Follow me. Yes, Your Majesty. <laughs> <laughs> Your chair, Your Majesty. It's called a throne rocket. Queens have thrones. What else would you like, Your Majesty? Um, uh, I know. Sing me a song. A song about a queen. Of course, Your Majesty. Yes, song. Sing song. <laughs> Pussycat, where have you been? Been to the palace to visit the queen. Pussycat, pussycat, what did you say? I helped her sit down on her special chair. Pussycat, pussycat, what have you seen? I saw the queen wearing a tambourine. And did it make a jangling sound? Every time the queen moved around. <laughs> Pussycat, Pussycat, what did she say? Everybody must sing and play. Pussycat, Pussycat, what did you do? I danced with the Queen for an hour or two. Come on then, Timbo, dance with me. Your <laughs> Majesty. <laughs> Good singing. Thank you, Your Majesty. Anything else you want, Your Majesty? Um, yes. I'm hungry. Thimbo, get me some crackers. Oh, yes, Your Majesty. Crackers. Good idea. Um, Pom, get me my doll. You know, little one. Go on. It's the game, like Flory says. I'm the Queen, so you've got to do what I say. Say yes. Yes, Your Majesty. Yes. <laughs> That's it. Now go and get Little One. Oh, Rocket, you get me my doll. <laughs> right away, Your Majesty. <laughs> uh, um, uh, Thimbo, what are you doing? Hmm? Those are the Queen's crackers, not yours. Oh, but I was hungry. You're not allowed to eat the Queen's crackers. Give them to me. Oh, all right. Uh, aren't you going to say thank you? <laughs> I'm the Queen. Queens don't have to say thank you. Hmm. Uh, uh, Pom have tambine now, please. No, Pom, you can't have it. Oh. Oh, go on, Flory. But I'm playing with it. 
Queens wear their crowns all the time, even when they go to bed. Don't go, Pom. Oh, where's Rocket? I'm waiting for Little One. Um, uh, I'd better go and see. No, Fimbo, come back. You've got to do what I say. It's the game. <sighs> Hello, Rocket. <laughs> cool. I've had enough of Queen Flory and her game. Me too. Oh, King Pom. King Pom. Hey, let's make you a crown so you can be a queen too. Oh, that's big. Cool. <laughs> what a tippity toppity idea. Now we need some card for the crown. Uh, here you are. Some jewels. Oh, sparkly. And some tissue paper. Oh, thank you, Pom. Pom helping. Now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, hello there, Flory. Hello, Roly. Why have you got a tambourine on your head? It's my crown. I'm Queen Flory. Oh, I see. Where are the others? They've gone away. We were playing a really good game. I was a queen and they were my helpers, but they wouldn't do what I said. Oh, why is that then, do you think? I don't know. Hmm. I know a story about a queen. Would you like to hear it? Oh, yes, please, Roly. Back in a Roly Mo. Books over here, books over there, books, books everywhere. When you take a look inside a book, it's fun as fun can be. Now what have we here? When you take a look inside a book, who knows what you might see? A story or rhyme, just take the time to read along with me. Are you still on your own, Flory? Well, never mind. Are you sitting comfortably? Then I'll begin. This story is called The Magic Words. Once upon a time there were two queens who each lived in a huge palace. The palaces were so big that the queens needed lots of help with the cleaning, cooking and gardening. Queen Bamboozler was very bossy and lazy. She spent all day sitting on her throne, ordering all her helpers about. Sweep the stairs, she screamed. Bring me my breakfast. Mow the lawn. The helpers didn't like being spoken to so rudely. They left the palace and found new jobs elsewhere. Soon the queen was on her own. The palace was dusty. The garden was full of weeds, and there wasn't one clean plate in the royal kitchen. I can't stay in a dirty place like this, cried Queen Bamboozler. So she decided to visit her cousin, Queen Sweetina, who lived on the hill next door. Queen Sweetina's palace was gleaming from top to bottom. The garden was full of beautiful flowers, and every evening a fantastic meal was put on the table. Queen Sweetina's helpers adored her. However do you do it? asked Queen Bamboozler. Oh, I just say the magic words, replied Queen Sweetina. Magic words? You mean like abracadabra? cried Queen Bamboozler. No, I mean like please and thank you. Queen Bamboozler was amazed. She realized that in all her years of being a queen, she'd never said please or thank you to anyone. No wonder all her helpers had gone away. She went straight back to her palace, determined never to be bossy again. And you'll be pleased to know that Queen Bamboozler said her first thank you to Queen Swatina for giving her such useful advice. I like Queen Swatina best, didn't you? Yes, Flory. Although Queen Bamboozler was fine once she knew how to say the magic words. Please and thank you. That's right. And I know another magic word. Oh, yes. And what's that then? 
Ah, and who does Queen Flory need to say that magic word to? Thimble and Rocket and Pom. See you later, Rolly. <laughs> we just need to add some jewels to your crown, like this. Pom helping. Oh, OK, you stick this one on. Oh, yes. There we are. Now, we're going to stick the ends together. Pom help you, Simba. OK, push there, push. <laughs> and now, the tissue paper. Oh, what a wonderful crown, Fimbo. <laughs> oh, I love the jewels. Are you going to be a king? <laughs> no, it's for Pom. Oh, lovely. Uh, come here, Pom. I'll just pop it on your head. Oh, thank you, Fimbo. Oh, Pom, you look like a princess. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> <laughs> princess Pom. <laughs> Are you still being Queen Flory? Yes, but this time I'm going to say all the magic words. Um, what magic words? Please and thank you. Uh, and sorry. I'm sorry I wasn't a very nice queen. Oh, that's all right, Your Majesty. We forgive you, Your Majesty. <laughs> You're a Majesty too now, Pom. Huh. Pom Majesty. <laughs> Would you like to hear a song, Princess Pop? Sure, yes, please. Thank you very much. Pussy and pussy cat, where have you been? I'm going to the palace to visit the queen. Oh, pussy cat, pussy cat, what do you do there? I helped her sit down on the special chair. The Fimbles had a busy day today. Do you remember who found the tambourine, my little sweetie cheapy? <laughs> yes, Flory. Now, usually you shake tambourines, but Flory put it on her head to be what? It's a crown. Queen Flory. Only she kept telling everybody what to do. Now, I don't think Thimble or Rocket or Pom liked it very much. That's why they went away to do something else, didn't they? Rolly Mo told Flory a story all about a bossy queen and a kind queen. And then dear Flory remembered those magic words. <laughs> Please, thank you and sorry. Now they're all friends again and Pom's a princess. <laughs> do you know, I think I'll try and make a little crown for my little love now. Maybe you could make one too and pretend to be a king or a queen. Come and find us next time, won't you? I must fly. Every girl, every boy, come and open up your eyes. There's a world right here. Circle. Pom, stick 
Just get it. Mm, screw it up and stick it down. Hello, love it. I say, hello. <laughs> Bessie calling. Oh, hello, Bessie. Hello. Hello, Bessie. You look very busy. May an old bird ask what you're making? Paper plate pies for our paper plate picnic. Picnic. Look what's on my plate, Bessie. Ooh. Ooh, is that an apple? <laughs> it looks good enough to eat, Fimble. <laughs> apple. Apple peas. <laughs> you hungry already, Pom? Yes, Pom have apple. I'll get you an apple, Pom. Hmm, I think I could do with a snack too. Da, 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 da. Oh. <laughs> oh, I'm getting that fimbling feeling. <laughs> I can feel a twinkling. I can hear a sound. It's telling me there's something waiting to be found. Where is it? Where is it? What could it be? I think it might be over there. Let's go and see. Wow. wow. It doesn't smell of anything. No. It doesn't make a noise. <laughs> Hello, Flurry. Rocket, look what I found. <laughs> well, tickle my tadpoles. Look at that. Do you know what it is? <laughs> I know what it could be. What? A drum. A really great drum. Do you think so? <laughs> oh, yes. Go on, Flurry. Give it a bang. <laughs> 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 oh, don't stop, Flurry. I was just thinking. It's just a size for you, Rocket. Perhaps you could sit on it. It could be a froggy chair. Oh, yes. Let's have a go. Um, just a minute. Look at those. Oh. Oh, maybe that's how you open it. Oh, go on. Open it up. Can't wait to see what's inside. Oh. Oh. Cool. Oh. Looks like you could do with some help. You're probably right. Bimba, look at Pom's picture. Oh, that lovely Pom. Um, what is it? Bimbo, Pom, come and see what I found. Oh, uh, coming. <laughs> Pom coming! Pom coming! Look at this! Oh! Hello, Rocky! <laughs> <laughs> We're having a little trouble opening it. Oh, right. Shall I have a go? Oh, come on. I can't wait to see what's inside. A new game to play, or treasure, or... Apple! Ah, uh, well, yes, it could be an apple, I suppose. There, I've done it. You can open it now. Oh, thank you. Ready? Uh, Ta-da! Oh. oh, oh, it's full of nothing. Cool. That's not very interesting, is it? Oh, don't you think so? Oh, Bessie, do you know what it is? Well, it's a suitcase, isn't it? Hello, suitcase. You take it with you when you go away on a trip. Oh, but we haven't anywhere to go. We hoped it would be full of treasure. But it's empty. If you ask me, empty suitcases are far more interesting than full ones. What do you mean? Well, just think of all the things you can put in an empty suitcase. Oh! Yeah. There's an empty suitcase. I wonder what she's going to put in it. She's putting her toys in it. Oops and daisy. <laughs> Oh, those are her clothes, aren't they, Bessie? Yes, that's right, Flurry. Plenty of room inside. Oh, you'd be amazed how much you could fit into an empty suitcase. Now, those look like pyjamas. Oh, 
and pink slippers. Oh, and a toothbrush. She must be staying the night. You need your toothbrush if you're staying the night. That's a nice red suitcase. I wonder who she's going to visit. Off they go. Goodbye, have a lovely time. Bye! Bye. <laughs> Why don't we go on a trip? Oh, yes. We could go to the seaside. Or the jungle. Chaka? Or on a paper plate picnic. Oh, now that's a good idea. A picnic. Nick, 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 Nick. We could put everything we need in the suitcase. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get packing. Zing, zing. <laughs> oh, we're going on a picnic. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Oh, we're going on a picnic. Suitcase. I'll try, Rocket. Oh, it won't shut. Oh, careful, Flory. Let me do it. Um. Oh, stop! Stop! Look, it's the ball's fault. It's too big. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Let's try again. Oh. Oh, hold on, hold on. This is sticking out too. <laughs> Bimbo. Oh, sorry, Flory. Just making sure it was shaking properly. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> there are just too many things in the case. That's the problem. Now what are we going to do? Oh, hello. What are you all up to then? Oh, we're going on a picnic. We've got too many things to put in our suitcase. Yes, too many. Well, then you'll just have to leave some things behind. Oh, yes, but what? How do we choose what to leave behind? Ah, if it's choosing you're doing, you'll need one of Roly's rhymes. <laughs> Back in a Roly bow. <laughs> When you take a look inside a book, who knows what you will see? When you take a look inside a book, it's fun as fun can be. With cats and dogs and birds and frogs, a monkey who says boo. boo. Wonderful things, giants and kings, and maybe a fiddle or two. What you might see. A story or rhyme, just take the time to read along with me. How can a rhyme help us choose, Roly? Listen and you will find out. I'm listening. Dory, Dory. Are you sitting comfortably? Yes. yes. <laughs> Good. Then let's begin. This story is called 
Eeny, me, meeny, miny, mo. Mo, roly mo. <laughs> <laughs> one day, Squirrel was playing with four friendly rabbits: a red one, a blue one, an orange one, and a green one. When it was time for the rabbits to go home, they couldn't decide who should be the first to hop down the hill. So they asked Squirrel to help them. I know," said Squirrel. "We'll play a choosing game." And this is how they played the choosing game. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Is it yes or is it no? Which will stay and which will go? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. The red one. Go on then. Off you go," said Squirrel. And the red rabbit hopped down the hill. Let's go again," said Squirrel. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Is it yes or is it no? Which will stay and which will go? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Right, Blue Rabbit, you can follow your friend. And the Blue Rabbit hopped down the hill. One, two, just two left now. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Is it yes or is it no? Which will stay and which will go? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Hop along home, and the orange rabbit hopped down the hill. And then there was only the green rabbit left to choose. So when the green rabbit had hopped down, all the rabbits waved to Squirrel from the bottom of the hill. Can we hear the rhyme again, please, Rolly? Oh, very well. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Is it yes or is it no? Which will stay and which will go? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Oh, please, can I have a go at the rhyme, Rolly? Oh, very well, Flory. Uh um, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Is it no or yes? It is. Which will stay and which will go? Eeny, meeny, Rolly, mo. Oh, 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 oh. Well, that's very good, Flory. Very good indeed. <laughs> Come on then, let's do the rhyme. Uh uh um. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Is it yes or is it no? Which will stay and which will go? Eeny, meeny, roly, mo. Who put that in? <laughs> I did. <laughs> we don't really need it for a picnic, do we, Thimbo? Well, I thought it it might come in useful, maybe for carrying water, or no, I suppose we don't really need it. <laughs> My turn now. Oh. <gasps> Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Is it yes or is it no? Which will stay and which will go? Eeny, meeny, roly, mo. Um, Rocket, is this yours? <laughs> uh, yes, that's my froggy cushion. But I suppose I can sit on a rock as usual. <laughs> oh, oh, Pom, you have a go now. Oh, yes, please. <gasps> <gasps> But, but, but that's my shimmy shaker. <laughs> oh, uh, Pom, try again. <gasps> oh, thank you, Pom. I'll take that out instead. Oh. Come on, let's try to shut it now. Okay. <laughs> Pom, push. Pom, push. Oh. Yay! Yay! Shut! Shut! Hey. Shut! Shut! Now we can go on our picnic. Yay! Yes. Yes. Oh, we're going on a picnic. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. No, we're not. Oh, the suitcase is too heavy. I can't lift it. Oh, oh dear. Perhaps I can help. Um, oh. Oh. Tom, you are clever. It's just what we need. Tom, clever. Ready, Thimbo? Uh, oh. <sighs> Tom, push your truck. Oh, oh, we're going on a picnic. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Oh, we're going on a picnic. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. There'll be lots of things to do, and you can all come to me 'cause we're going. Yes, we are. Oh, we're going on a picnic. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Oh, we're going on a picnic. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Oh, we're going on a picnic. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Oh, we're going on a picnic
And who wants a cracker? Oh, yes, yes, please. please. <laughs> Here you are, Rocket. <laughs> oh, there you go, little one. I hope you like your new bed. Bessie was right, wasn't she? Empty suitcases are very useful things. Shh, little one's asleep. Chickadee, the Fimbles had a busy day today. Can you remember who found the suitcase? <laughs> it was Flory. Flory found an empty suitcase. And at first, she didn't know what to put in it. Then everybody put all their picnic things in the suitcase. <laughs> but there were so many things that they couldn't close the lid. <laughs> So they had to choose some things to take out. Rolly helped them learn a choosing rhyme. Do you remember how it went? <laughs> yes, of course, my little bundle of fluff. Of course I'll teach it to you. Let's say it together. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Which will stay and which will go? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. <laughs> Next time you find an empty box, think what interesting things you could put in it. Come and find us next time, won't you? I must fly. Goodbye! <laughs>